Hello everyone, this video is about the immune system and the mark of the beast. Um, before I start off this video, uh, let us pray first. Heavenly Father God, Holy Spirit, Lord Jesus Christ, I pray that all the viewers viewing this video will understand your message clearly and they will choose to obey your message. In Jesus Christ's name, amen. All right, so this message is only for people who have received uh, Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior and developed a direct relationship with Jesus Christ. So again, this video is going to talk about the immune system of our bodies and the mark of the beast. Uh, Holy Spirit says, these are the 10 ways people can get the mark of the beast that is linked to a decreased immune system so number one chemotherapy number two dialysis number three prescription maintenance drugs and all man-made medicine for example pain relievers etc Number four, vaccines. Five, radiation and EMF, which is electromagnetic field. Um, that is the 5G that is happening worldwide right now that is being set up uh, around the world. Number six, panic, fear, worry, and stress will decrease your immune system. Number seven, seasonal sicknesses, for example, uh, dengue in Asian countries, uh, flu, uh, etc. Uh, number eight, hunger due to famine or lack of food, not able to produce and or deliver food in supermarkets or uh, wet markets. Uh, number nine, buy, sell food water and things and number 10 natural disasters that create fear worry and panic will decrease our immune system so that is the 10 ways that um, can decrease your, our immune system which will lead people to depend on the government and the government in the future will soon force people to get um, the mark of the beast so if you are dependent on these things you better uh, ask jesus christ right now how can you be free from this and uh, you better start trusting and depending on jesus christ alone um, 100% on him only and not on people or not on things because once you get that mark of the beast it's through you're never ever able to repent of your sins never able to enter heaven anymore because it will change the way you think and the way you feel you won't be able to repent because they will really control your emotions and your mind and this is what Heavenly Father God told me to share to everyone, uh, to warn everyone that you better start depending 100% on Jesus Christ. Um, and if you have trouble doing this, uh, releasing this uh, dependency on people and medicines and things of the world, you better start practicing now uh, before it's too late. You don't want to get that mark of the beast on you, okay? It will be in the hand and it can be in the uh, head, forehead, or the brain, okay? That, that way they will track you wherever you are uh, and they'll know uh, what you're doing, what you plan to um, do or think because um, it's uh, there. The technology now is, is very uh, high-tech um, 
and you don't want that. You don't want that, Mark. Uh, you'll lose your salvation instantly. There is no repentance on that. So uh, let this be a warning to you all and uh, start practicing on depending solely on Jesus Christ only. Please uh, have mercy on your soul uh, and uh, share this to everyone that you love that uh, you don't want to go to hell for this uh, this mistake and Satan will deceive many people and it's not uh, he's not going to say to you that this is a uh, take this mark or take this chip uh, and uh, if you want to serve me no he will force it to people because of uh, you'll need it you'll need food you'll need water you'll need uh, work to live and um, that's the time when you really need to depend on God alone there's and if be prepared to die for Jesus Christ if you really love Jesus Christ you will depend on him fully 100% and obey him so this is a warning to all please take it seriously start repenting of your sins and start developing and maintaining a direct relationship with Jesus Christ ask him what you should do for him and do it right now okay um, this is the end of the message may Father God Holy Spirit Lord Jesus Christ give you the love peace wisdom and understanding of Jesus Christ in your mind and heart every day of your life in Jesus Christ's name amen